Hey Beer Geeks, welcome to the fanciest hotel we've ever stayed in on the channel and also welcome to Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania, as the locals call it. <laughs> yeah, it's this really uh, arable, uh, out in the sticks kind of feel yeah. uh, where there's lots of trashy but wonderful traditions. Yeah. Uh, lots of Amish people as well. Yeah. That's been exciting to see. Beautiful New England like scenery. Yeah. All the leaves are changing. Yeah, we're here in the fall and it's beautifully hiking. red. We've been hiking, we've been driven Trail. around. Yeah. Amazing. Driven around to lots of breweries out in the sticks. We've got lots of cool content coming. Uh, but we thought we'd release this video, A, because it's quick, and B, because, <laughs> well, uh, it's a really cool thing. What are we going to be drinking? Well, as soon as we got here the other night, I spied at the bar that they had a Younglings and Hershey chocolate beer. Yeah, so this came out to quite a lot of fanfare about a year ago. Yingling are actually the oldest and I think the biggest craft brewery uh, in the whole of America. They make yeah. an amber lager that's pretty good um, and lots of local varieties as well, but they've just come out. Apparently the daughters are taking over the brewery and they were like, this is gonna be a cool thing. Yeah. So Yingling is based in Pennsylvania. Hershey's is based right round the corner from us, basically in Hershey. Uh, Pennsylvania just outside of Harrisburg where the university we've been speaking at is um, so we thought while in the shadow of Hershey Park of those roller coasters we should try this ridiculous smash up of old companies all of the Hershey chocolates versus <laughs> in the Hershey front. chocolate beer Yingling chocolate beer yeah so this is the Hershey and Yingling chocolate stout um, we had it drunk at the bar after a whole day's adventuring. So we've had it before, but we don't really remember it. Um, I don't even remember yeah. that. I think I was just <laughs> super jet lagged. So That's crazy drunk. So this is made with Hershey chocolate syrup, I believe, uh, and then a classic porter. They're, the Yingling have a porter, so I assume it's a little blend of those two. <laughs> silly chocolate isn't it? I mean I'm not a big lover of American chocolate I find it way too sweet and kind of powdery and that's what that aroma is I mean I've, I've had the Hershey's syrup at home and it does it just it smells a lot like it yep. to be honest it's almost like a, a kind of sickly sweetness to it it has got a gradiness to it as, as, as well though like a proper like uh, caramel dust kind of smell to it presumably doing the cupboard sniff coming off of the uh, the uh, the stout Yes. Yep. Let's give it a go. Okay. It's not as sweet as I was expecting, actually. No, it finishes quite sweet, but it's pretty yeah. dry and portery at the start. Dark fruits, roastiness, like a lightly roasted coffee. And then that sort of fades away and you're left with that up in your grill kind of sweet American mm. chocolate thing. Um, it's pretty, it's, 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 uh. it's pretty alright to be honest. <laughs> it's better than I thought it was going to be. Yeah. I was already, with Hershey chocolate, I was already to hate that and it's yeah. pretty good. I kind of want to, I need to try it with some chocolate, so, because uh, I think it could be more chocolatey. <laughs> <laughs> I think it could be less chocolatey, Brad disagrees. <laughs> I got a sweet tooth. I'm, I'm going to go uh, with, the, with the butter, the, I, the Reese's mini. I'm going for the crack because What's more fun than the crack? And what's more addictive than crack? Mm. That's the Irish crack. So grainy. It's actually better with, with the chocolate in it. Yeah, it feels more... Well, it's got that more, more sweetness. It's more rounded now. Yeah. It's bigger. Somehow it's Some, made it bigger. Somehow it's bigger. They've come together as a kit of parts. Well, it's because the core ingredient of both of these things is chocolate syrup. Like, oh yeah. That's all we've done. We've topped up the chocolate syrup element. <laughs> so it's like a really, if you ever made your own chocolate milkshake at home and it tells you to put like two scoops in and you put about five scoops in. Because it never quite completely goes in, does it? It never yeah. goes completely soluble. God damn, that's quick. Other brands are available. Other brands are available. Unless Nesquik want to be a Patreon supporter. It's Nestle though, mate. Yeah, we don't want them. Um, so we'd love to know if you guys have tried this and what you think of this. To be honest, so many American beer labels of, of craft breweries are stealing the look of many brands constantly doing IP theft. Yeah. So this time, I feel like Yingling have just skipped, skipped that step and actually approached the brewery, got their chocolate syrup, and I think it's pretty tasty. I think it's a great uh, hookup as well because it's they're both big Pennsylvania companies, mm. both historic brands. So what do you 
think of American chocolate? Uh, I can feel the beady eyes staring at me through uh, the screens on YouTube. That's why I'm letting you answer don't, first. Don't kill me, guys, but I mean, American chocolate, Hershey's chocolate. I feel like we're bugged as well because we're in the heart of Hershey land. Um, for us, as, as people from the UK, it doesn't quite taste like chocolate. It's, no. It's got a very kind of peculiar taste. It's not definitely not Cadbury, let's say that. It's grainy, it's sweet, it's much less milky than Cadbury's. Less milky, less smooth. Yeah. And, um, and you know, Galaxy, that's like liquid the moment you put it in your mouth, so it's the opposite yeah. of that. It's not that I don't like it, I like it, but it's, it's chocolate, but not as we know. Mm. Um, and I know that's controversial to say that, and obviously Americans be like, what are you on about? This is, this is the gold standard. But um, I'll take it all back actually, it's pretty good. <laughs> Chocolate, isn't it? Chocolate, isn't it? So yeah, we've got lots of cool content coming out. We've been to Forest of Maine, we've been to Trogues, which is like 100 meters from Hershey. Uh, and we've also been to New Trail, who are a great craft brewery that we think in about a year's time, you're gonna hear a lot about. We've got a video and a hike with them as well. Amazing. So check out those coming up and in the meantime, let us know what you think of Hershey's chocolate, what you think of this beer, and if you've ever been to PA, all your favorite breweries from there. But from us, it's, uh, hey, this trashy smash up isn't that bad. Cheers.